How's it going everyone? Welcome back to the deep end. My name is Brendan. Today we're going to be going over our third installment of Shipwrecks of the Outer Banks. Uh, today's video is going to take us to Salvo, North Carolina. Uh, the shipwreck we're going to be going over today is called the Pocahontas. The Pocahontas is a wooden wheeled steamer um, located off of Sand Street. It's about 75 yards from shore. It's about 10 to 15 feet of water and Sand Street can be found on the south side of Salvo. If you're coming from Avon, it's about four to five streets in. Uh, if you're coming from the north, it's towards the end. Uh, I don't know how many streets to get to there from the north side of Tri-Villages. On January 28th, 1862, the Pocahontas was actually caught up in a bad storm which led to overexertion on the engine. The steamers were just putting off too much power and it actually sprung a leak which eventually led to the downfall of the Pocahontas landing in Salvo. And actually, the Chicopacomico Life Saving Station wasn't established until 1874, so there were no lifesavers out there to assist this boat. But thankfully, no lives were lost. Sadly, the only lives that they did lose on the ship were 90 of the 114 horses used in the Calvary. Now, what can be seen at the Pocahontas is when you walk on the beach at Sand Street, or generally anywhere near the wreck, is a you can see one of the large paddle shafts actually sticking out of the water. Under the water, there's large engine parts. There's another paddle shaft under there. Um, that's generally all the wreck is. I'm not sure if it's fully covered up or those are just like the pieces that are still left behind. Me and my friend Dan actually checked out the wreck about two years ago. I haven't been back since, but this summer we plan on going to adventuring to it, you know, checking it out, hopefully getting some fish off it and getting some really cool underwater footage on a nice clear day. Hope you guys all enjoyed the educational history um, about the Pocahontas wreck. Um, and now we're gonna show some aerial footage that we shot recently and some other photos that I found online of the wreck and I hope you guys all enjoy that and I'll see you at the end. Thank you guys for viewing today's video. If you liked the video, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, hit that button, and we'll see you guys in the next one.